Welcome to the Circle of Dawn. Enjoy. Vanessa, can you roll Danger Sense, please? Right, as you are coming through town and, uh, and uh, about to head out of town, um, Vanessa, you sense um, something uh, kind of like a sound from the well. And as you turn around, you see coming out of the well a kind of like black sludge. Um, and it kind of like flicks back whatever it looks like this sludgy thing and then goes and fires forward and you see um several black sludge uh round uh um well balls um come shooting towards you i'm giving the signal from obviously from fighting the thieves. yeah the only one who can act at the moment is you uh, i'm probably gonna run in the direction to the right and shoot it okay go ahead What are you shooting it with? Yeah, it's an old Morbo. Okay. Um, okay, that hits. Okay, so the the arrow hits it, and as it hits it, it kind of like just melts away. Yeah. So we're gonna have to hit it with magical type weapons potentially. And it starts to uh, um, flop over the edge of the well as it moves towards you. So the uh, three, uh, well, a barrage of ball things, uh, black ball things, come firing towards you all. Has anyone got a physical defence 11 or lower? Uh, yeah. Me. Okay, anyone else? Uh, mine's 11. Wait, 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 combat. Actually, do we still have the? No, uh, yeah, yeah, it's uh, it's all, it's lower. Thanks, Wonky. I should be at nine. Yours is at twelve. It says here. Yeah, that's that's too Kali much. Asked, yours is nine, and yeah, I fixed it. Vanessa's it was eleven. Not... Randomly, I don't know what sort of buff we had on, but it was. Okay, so what Should is your come on? Is yours twelve then? Yeah. No, no, no. it's ten. Nine, nine natural plus one from the from the uh, buckler. Why does it say I twelve then? Physical yeah, defense the, I'm, twelve. I'm, There's no mods. I'm trying to find out. You've got one the... physical. Oh no, that's yeah. Physical defense. You've got one on the on the adjust sheet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, That's probably my, come my, from... my natural, my natural from Dex is eight. Plus one from the um, from the from the uh, discipline. Yeah. So I should be at ten, and the two difference would be explained with the shield willow, but it's not active. So, and it's not in the. Oh no! Actually, my uh, natural is nine. Plus one from the discipline. Oh, I'm at eleven. I should be. So no one's got it's... higher than eleven. Yep. Yep. Okay. So, um, these uh round black balls come firing towards you in all directions, as if it's kind of like just a a scattergun approach. There's there's shitloads of them coming um shooting towards you. Uh, and you all take uh, six points of uh, damage. Physical armor um, does not affect it. Mystic armor does. Uh, Kurdar manages to dodge out the way and doesn't actually get hit by one. Now it's initiative. So you've taken six damage minus Mystic. Twenty-one. Yeah. Uh, Komalan? Yeah, I'm coming. Yep. And, and I fixed the physical defense. 
Okay, that's cool. It's it's ten actually. Um, you uh, you all now, now you've been uh, surprised by this mound cra crawling out of the well. You all recognise it as very similar to the mound that you've uh, just seen towards the uh, north west of the uh, of the town. So, uh, Vanessa. All right. So we're going to try and shoot with spells at range, or we're going to try and fight in combat. Feel free to do whatever works best for you. So you saw a stick being melted away, and I will um, assume, be kind, that Cormalan would have said that looks like acid. It's up to you, Vanessa, okay, what you want to do. Bear in mind, you. Uh, um, well, hmm, I don't know. Don't know if you know. Hmm. So the problem is fighting in combat, my magic sword may or may not be okay, but I'll be next to it. If not, I can throw a set of those thrown daggers at it, the magical ones we found, but then they may well disappear if this thing eats them too. How would your fire sword react with this? I don't know, there's only one way of knowing, and that would be to hit it. Does it oh, fire use one of its fireball? abilities. <laughs> yeah, there's no point of flame weapon at the moment. But yeah, but there is point of one of its abilities. Fireball. Yeah, we'll give that one a go. It's <laughs> Just finding the sword on the list. You've got an actual fireball up your sleeve, and now you're telling us. Uh, yep. Throughout this whole fight. Yep. That we almost died. Yep. Oh, and he nice just... one. No, you had it for the fight at uh, at Hoenn. Yeah, but there was no point fireball in there. They were in combat. If I'd fireballed the party, that's the D and D classic wipe the group out. But I can fireball this because there's nobody within six thousand meters of it. Go for it. Uh, Six thousand yeah. meters. <laughs> um, I can shoot fireball once per day, so I've no idea how good the fireball is. Well, it's, now it, it's, it's the same as out. thread, so it's 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 basically the fireball spell in the book, which I've given you the page for, and you've got five threads, so it counts as uh, 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 as if you've got it at. Oh, let me have the look. Fireball. Yeah, so it's a fifth circle spell. You've got it at five, so it's your will plus four. Uh, well, will plus five. Uh, sorry, will plus nine. That's fine. It's will's five, so fourteen. Can I add karma to it or not? No. Hang on a minute. So, um, out of character, just for rules clarification, because uh, I hadn't thought about this before. When you're casting a spell from an item that has that spell imbued upon it, so fireball. I would. You've still got to roll spell casting, haven't you? That'll be spell casting if it's five threads woven to it. So it'll be perception plus five to actually, or, or not, or does that not count? Open to debate. Actually, I'm not sure if casting spells from items is a thing at all in official publications, but I'm not sure. You just have to make something up on the fly and then we'll sort it out after. Yeah. It's not a regular thing, at least, I'm pretty sure. Oh really? Oh, okay. Oof. Make it an ability or something. Uh, uh, I would. Okay, so for I that, would... you sh it should give you spell casting level of whatever to be able to cast it. So five. Cast the spell, and then the effect of the spell plus. Okay, so all right, I'll make a ruling for now, and then we'll I'll, I'll investigate it and sort that afterwards. So at the moment, so you still got to do spell casting. So it's so it's perception plus five. All right, so perception plus five is twelve. That'll be against their mystic defense to begin with, and then we'll do the effect test afterwards. Yeah, because you can't really avoid doing the hack and just do an effect test, can you? Not really, no. Uh, fifteenth against Mystic Defense. That's uh, a success. So now you can roll the effect test, which is Will plus nine. So that's against uh, Mystic Armor. Okay, plus that. Right, the um creature um as it's um enveloped. In the uh, fireball, um, rives about uh, as it flops over the edge of of the well and and spreads out to uh, um, uh, ten meters flat on the floor. 
and um, you see the uh, fireball envelop it and I think it's doing quite a significant amount of damage to it. Seems to have tried to flatten itself on the floor in some kind of way of protecting itself. Formalan. So, sorry? It's Did your you go, Formalan. Oh, okay, sorry. I I will start thread weaving and um, start uh, weaving for an elemental spear. You missed me Fire. saying something. Uh, you missed me saying Hello? something. You... Is that why you said sorry? Yeah, I, I just missed my, my missed my cue apparently. Oh, right. Okay. Just but, 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 sure but, 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 yeah, yeah. I, I, I heard the, the uh, fireball hurts. Okay. Hurts the cool. thing and it's oozing out. Yeah. yeah. Um, I will start thread weaving. Um, so it's eight. Uh, well, no point in having karma and not using it. <laughs> Uh, but, yeah. but, but that's against Mystic Defense, yeah? No, no, oh, that's no, just you, thread, that's you, weaving thread weaving now. Yeah, okay, fine. Yeah. yeah. Sadly, sadly, the elemental spears need, it, need one thread. It stinks, but it's true for a little, little longer. Yeah. And... Can't wait for the enhanced <laughs> matrix, can you? Yes, exactly. <laughs> um, and just as a side note, as I realized it, uh, last week and this week, we forgot to do the declarations before rolling initiative again so for me Weird. that was for aaron i mean i i'm fine if you want to do declarations you can do declarations I, i'm i'm easy on that if i mean in, in some respects i like it as long as it doesn't slow things down because i i like adding that extra dimension of you, you role playing exactly what you're going to do in, yeah in in uh not not to be discussed now, but I think we might have a character soon that relies heavily on the initiative part, and so it's probably good to keep 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 it up. But okay, um, yeah, yeah, I'm 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 thread weaving. I am uh, probably riding over here while doing it. Um, yeah, that's that's all for now. So just to just to give you a sense of dimensions, this thing like you saw before was like one and a half cows. But this one is kind of like it's like a sludgy material that that's now flattened itself onto the floor, and it's covering a good um, two meters uh, uh, squared. Hang on, well, so two meters diameter, so four meters wide, four meters uh, um, thick. So that's why it's covering um, eight squares in total. It's flattened itself completely on the floor. Big one. And uh, you done, Comalan? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, Kalias. Okay, I am weaving a thread for Astral Spear. Ah, <laughs> dirt. Is that is that enough? <laughs> it actually is enough. Um, fine. It it needs a five. That's a six. So that works. And I will, uh, because I'm thread weaving as my free action, I will use Astral Strain on this uh thing to lower its mystic defense if I can do it. So that will be spell casting and boom. Eleven. Does that beat the mystic defense? It does not, no. Okay. So it doesn't have any effect. Next. Me done. Uh, 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 okay, so that's uh, Kindar Oak and Fury. He um, gets out his bow and uh, 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 promptly fires two arrows at it. Shit in hell. <laughs> I've just rolled 57. Oh, so much help. That's a shame. He missed okay. you. Oh, no. What am I doing? That's wrong, isn't it? 57, so that's uh, minus nine extra successes. So he fires one arrow. Um, that goes, uh, sticks straight into it for um, 24 points of damage. However, you see it stick into it, and um, the, the, uh, uh, um, the arrow head um, sticks into it but uh, and, and stays in it. And the rest of the um, the arrow shaft itself just melts away. But you do see the the creature kind of like um, respond 
in a in, in a way where you think it's taken a hit. It means the sword probably wouldn't dissolve, although I might. And its second arrow uh, goes whizzing pie and misses. Now the black mound. Hmm. Okay. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Wow, you've paced yourselves, uh, separated yourselves really well, haven't you? <laughs> Uh, okay, it doesn't really know what it's doing, so I'm going to roll a step four. So Cormelan is one, Kalias is two, uh, Kerdar is three, and uh, uh, Vanessa is four. Roll. Ah, uh, I got a one. So that's uh, Cormelan. So a uh, another black snowball kind of like thing comes uh, shooting um, out from it. Does it kind of like... Uh, it's flat on the ground a a a part of its kind of like mound comes up moves back and then flings part of it towards you lovely okay. uh i try to avoid blow okay yeah, yeah that's it so go uh, ahead wait wait can you uh huh can you avoid blow for uh ranged attacks yes yes nice. that's it's not any any physical attack basically by now I mean, of course, if if uh, there's a sniper shooting in the head from behind, you can't. But you, in this case, I think I can because I see it thrown. Right then. We go it ten. Well, actually, I think it's also time to put some karma into it. Sixteen. Okay, so the uh, the bolt comes uh, flying towards you. You manage to kind of like just duck to the side as you see the bolt, uh, the, the, the black snowball thing hit the side of the building and melts part of the wood as it as the acid affects the wood and just melts it to the floor. Mm-hmm. Okay, declarations. Casting a spell. Yeah, also casting a spell. Uh, Kedar is going to... Um, He's going to move back a bit, and he's going to continue using his uh, his uh, bow um, uh, to fire at the creature. Ba -ba -ba -ba. So let's roll his initiative. Yes, so that's that. Um, I uh, please push me, push me back in the initiative. Um, if I'm too late, I will have to leave for just a minute or so and kiss okay. someone. Good night. Be right back. Nessa, initiative. Yay. All I'm going to do anyway is consider it. I'm out of range to get to it in one round, so I'd actually prefer it to walk forward. I kind of like, um, I hate rolling d12s, always have. Uh, uh, so, uh, yeah, go uh, ahead. Yeah, you've already done casting it. Casting my spell, that's yeah. 15. Does that beat? Does it miss a defense? Yes, it does. No extra successes. So. Uh, no extra successes, right? Yep. No, there's none, and therefore I will roll will plus four. Will plus four. Wait, and casting? I'm going. Uh, this is astral spear. Astral spear. Yep. And in fact, I will use my desperate spell charm to boost the effect up a little bit, and so I will add another plus six to it. Oh, go ahead. So let's do it. Is that tech strain as well? No. That's yeah, I've already paid my blood damage magic. for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please roll decently. Go, go, go. Oh, that'll do. So that's uh, 23 against Mystic Army, yeah? Yeah. So, uh, that's, uh, uh, uh yep. Yeah. An astral spear forms in Kalias's hands and he launches it at the uh, mound in the hope to pierce its pattern. Oh, does it do something specific then? That's... No, specifically deals 24 damage, 23. <laughs> Doesn't do anything else, just... Ethereal spear, uh, uh, right, okay. Uh, b -b 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 oh, it's a black mound. Um, yeah, oh my... Uh, D4. And... Oh, I should roll this on the screen, shouldn't I? Four. So it's uh, Vanessa. Um, I'm no, 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 no. It's attacking you, not your go. 
Uh, um, so it's flattened out on the floor still, and uh, a, a, a tendril of black sludge comes up, uh, curls back, and throws um, part of itself towards you in a um, snowball-y kind of like way. And hits to avoid blow or anything like that. Yeah, I was just saying I do have avoid blow as an optional talent, so we'll give it a go. What do I need to be? Not telling you. I'm telling you it hits. <laughs> and that's not enough. Okay, and your physical defense is 11, yep. Okay. Yes. So that's uh, 11. Right, okay. That's that. This black sludgy substance comes flying towards you and does uh, 17 points of uh, damage minus Mystic Armor. So a curious thing that you notice, uh, Cormelan, uh, from previously, um, even though it seems to be throwing off a part of itself, when it it's hit um, Vanessa, you don't see it acting like an acid. Hmm. That's handy. Interesting. What what is it acting like? Is it just more like, like a spell? A hmm. Okay. But when it hit the barn. Yeah. Inanimate object, it burnt the barn. That's peculiar. I will have to investigate. You see, that's an acid that'll be worth a lot of money. Yes. Um, I will keep that in mind. And, uh, and it does it have point. multiple? Yep, okay. Then I will um, now finish casting the elemental spear. Oh, hang on. Sorry. Uh, it is your go. But it, uh, after it's cast that spell, it flattens itself. Oh, go ahead. Okay, yeah, I will in this whole mess try to find a point to connect my spell to, finding some kind of pattern in dribbling mass to bind my spell into and put some more karma into it. And be kind of underwhelmed. Does it hit at least? Against Mystic Defense, yeah. That's missed. Uh, wait, yeah, I think it's also. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's just missed. Then. Yeah, then, then my spear doesn't even really materialize and dissipates before it leaves my hand. Because it has no way or nowhere to go. That would be a fire one as well, I guess. Yes. Okay. Uh, Kindar Open Fury. He takes uh, and he uh, gets out his uh, trusty bow again and uh, shoots off two arrows towards the uh, sludgy entity. Oh, oh. 57, though. But uh, that. Uh, uh, uh. Connection successes. Arrow goes shooting off towards the uh, sludgy entity, and uh, again you see the uh, arrow head sticking to it, and um, but the rest of the wooden arrow just melts away, uh, but the metal doesn't, um, and does quite a significant amount of damage. You see, fires his other arrow. Pressing these like three times, uh, and uh, okay, and that goes uh, whizzing by and hits the house behind. And now it's uh, Vanessa. Yeah, I'm just going to walk about three squares forward. I'm going to be out of range. Yep, there we go. That's my go to. I'll go in defense. Okay, here. so you've seen metal arrowheads hit it and not melt. You've seen a sludge snowball hit the side of a house that was wood and melt. Yeah, I'll shoot a normal arrow out of them. Uh, that's hit and, uh, oh, just one extra success. I did better while I was in defensive stance than I did last round. So 13 points of damage, so that's, uh, uh, what, is that an arrow, yeah? Yeah. As per, the, uh, the arrowhead sticks into it, but the, uh, the rest of the, the wooden bit of the arrow melts away. Um, and upon hitting it, it uh, spreads out even further. 
and as it spreads out even further you see around the uh, um, well there's not edges of a circle is there? Uh, around the sides of the um, um, black mold you see several tentacles start rising up at the uh, uh, at the edges of the uh, of the mold itself and all kind of like arriving about as if they're kind of like going to do something but you're not quite sure for what you've seen from it is doing before it might be it might be about to throw off a significant number of its black uh, uh, snowball kind of things declarations red weaving Indar's gonna do his uh, bow and arrow trick again and he's gonna use karma one oh. Wow, how many defaults is that? <laughs> yeah, giant dice hiding my icon. Okay, Vanessa. Um, I'm gonna. Well, I'm in defensive stance currently, but when no, I'm... that was just a roll initiative. You're not rolled initiative, so it's uh, Kindar Oak and Fury first. So, as per, he will uh, fire one of his arrows straight at it. Okay, he um strings the uh, arrow ready to uh, shoot at th at the mound as previously and as he lets go the uh, the string on his uh, bow snaps and it all drops to the floor Formalan. um thread weaving again for an elemental spear because in theory it's the right choice to do uh, you know what i will add an extra thread into it for um, for for uh, um, extra uh, plus two steps on the damage, and then I will throw karma into it. That's enough for one thread, but not enough for the extra thread. So next turn I will be stuck with thread weaving again. Too bad. Oh, because if you intend to roll an extra one, you don't get the first one because you're trying for two. No, you get no, the I, first I, one, I, but you don't get the second one, and you have to finish weaving what you started. Oh, it requires two threads. Okay, right. Kalias? Yeah, I, I, declare, I declare two threads. Right, okay. Yeah. As I mentioned, I am weaving a thread. This time I am weaving a thread for um, uh, spirit darts, in fact, and they will be cast with extra successes. And I have got this in my special matrix so that's a nice extra thread um and i will also try to lower his mystic defense um using my knuck so go it's, for it it's <laughs> whatever <laughs> did i just misgender your blob yes it's hardly it got a gender has it <laughs> that's because blob is male in polish um, oh, however, I believe God. that he gets minus. <laughs> it gets it gets minus two to his its mystic defense. Mystic defense. Okay. Yep. That's Until down. the end of next round, and that's me done. Okay. And uh, Vanessa. I'm uh, going to go aggressive start from next to attack it. Okay. Go ahead. So I'm going to attack it. Second attack and additional weapon. Okay, that, that hits, and that's uh, b -b 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 uh, that's three extra successes. That's plus six damage for that strike. Twenty-five. Okay, your um, sword goes uh, scything um, through it. Um, it hisses as it does so, um, and as it comes out the other side, uh, you have a quick glance of it and seems to be okay. But I'm now doing my second attack. Hey, what the hell? It's rolled both together. I think, or did I just roll a lot of eights? No, I must have rolled both together. Yeah, that's gone a bit crazy. Yeah, because it should only be step 16 with calm on it. Step 16. Second yeah, I've attack, got, have you? It's all good, plus three to second attack. Oh, you're aggressive? I'm aggressive as well. Oh, okay. I don't understand. That 16 looked pretty decent. Uh, the 40. 
There's nothing wrong with this. Wrong. There is. What? Forty. <laughs> but that's that's the genuine roll. It just okay. eight exploded okay. twice. Yeah. So yeah, the second attack was a forty. Eight, sixteen, ten, twenty. As long as 30. Vanessa's second attack step is actually sixteen. Yeah. It doesn't. No, it does. if you look at the roll, it doesn't add up. It does. Okay, so we got eight, eight, two. That's uh, oh no, I did sixteen, didn't I? Eighteen, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty-four. Oh yeah, that is right. Right. Okay, so that's uh, b -b 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 okay. that's five extra successes. <laughs> Pretty big. That's mm -hmm. your second. Attack. Attack. Yeah. Yeah, and then I just got my second weapon skill, and then I'll add my damage on for strength. Yeah, hang on a moment. Okay, you go to uh, strike it with that um, second attack, and I have rolled fifty-four, so don't give me that shit. And um, its tentacles that are all round the sides of it um, catches your sword as you're about to um, hit it, and moves it moves the sword to the side, and then. Slaps you round the face, right? And does does uh nineteen points of damage minus physical armor. What was that nineteen? Yep, minus physical armor. Yeah, so I should be on thirty-three. Yep, yeah, there we go. So you've still got your uh second weapon attack, Ellie. Second attack. Now, second weapon attack. Yep. Night fine. No. hit. And uh, that is uh, 12. Uh, 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 four. E hang on. Yeah, four extra successes. Oh, night fine. Not bad. Okay. Um, again, as, as um, previously, your uh, sword seems to go cleanly through it. You don't actually feel any resistance. At, at all as it's uh, going through it um, and you have a quick glance at your sword and it uh, seems okay you done yeah yeah it's me yeah. so the uh, creature that uh, you saw at the end of uh, last uh, well beginning of the, yeah the end of last round throwing all these tentacles up um, beside it on on its outer edge edges all the tentacles um, basically come crashing down inside uh, on top of the creature and it shrinks down to an even smaller size but then you see um, its whole um, surface of it starts bubbling and, and popping and uh, it kind of like writhes a little bit and then seems to have stopped doing anything at this moment in time but you do see that the arrowheads that um, uh, uh, um, Open Fury has uh, fired into it um, come popping out onto the floor. Boiling blood. Now it's uh, b -b 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 Declaration. declarations. Yep. I'm gonna cast a spell. Uh, might be the same thing. Attack it with everything I've got if I can see it. Some more thread weaving. Pindar's going to. Uh, Fire. Well, no, he's not. He's going to uh, move forward to engage in uh, melee combat. Okay, so that's uh, oh, me first. I want to run step five. Uh, b -b 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 the mound uh, slithers to the edge of the well. And uh, starts to kind of like it, you, you see um, parts of it grab hold of the side of the well as it's kind of like starting to move itself down. You can see that its surface is still bubbling uh, um, and popping quite a lot. Vanessa, yeah. can't get this on the centre. There, there we go. Let it get away. We'll try and hit it with everything again. Hope we get lucky. Yeah, it's just the first one we attacked. 28, so that's uh, 
That's three extra successes. I mean, this is pretty disgusting. What is? These rolls. <laughs> um, I'm a merchant. If these were real rolls on a, on, on, a, on a live table, I'd be wanting to take these dice away from you. <laughs> I'm, I'm a glass cannon. I'm just here to be a combat machine. Uh, 32... Minus that, so that's... Okay, as per usual, your uh, sword goes spinning through it. Instantly starts to seal and hiss. Um, I'm going to try my second attack on it. Yep, go ahead. Uh, that's hit. Okay, so your um, sword um, hits it, um, but instantly just bounces off seem to penetrate it at all it's got like at least armor 12 then so i'm i'm gonna do my last attack and then after we probably won't hit with something like fire if we've got it say that again so we probably won't hit with something like fire so next round i'll probably try and set my sword on fire and hit it but we'll see probably should have done that before you even okay uh that's missed all right that's me then uh, but, but, but Oak and Fury comes uh, running forward to oh, him done. Uh, Cormelan. Still thread weaving. That's so. Uh... Yep. But at least it's enough. Yay! <laughs> and maybe, maybe I will walk over here or right over here to be close by enough to throw the spear down the well if it comes. Okay. And uh, Kalias. Okay, so I will now cast my improved spirit darts, which are very much improved because they are also in the special matrix. Plus two, is that? Or plus three? Now? Yeah. yeah. 11, but it has got the lowered um, mystic yeah. defense. You need so... a 12. Hmm. Okay. Minus two. That doesn't work then. Yep. yep. Okay. And um, initiative declarations. Uh, Oak and Fury is going to move forward and try and hit it. <sighs> oh, how many ones? <laughs> Uh, Kalias. Oh my god. I'm gonna try again. Spirit dart the bastard away. Okay. You definitely get the sense now, as you've seen it being damaged and then bubbling away, that it seems to be restoring some of the damage that it's previously taken. 15. Uh, 15, that hits. Okay. So... Even the minus two doesn't account now, does it? But it still hits. It's it's gone now. Yeah, still hits. Okay. That's eleven damage. Eleven damage from a spirit dart. Okay, so that. And if it's got any mystic armor, it's got minus two for the next couple rounds. Minus two mystic armor, yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Uh. Kurdar, um, he's going to move in um, with his uh, uh, two short swords. Oh, it's only until the next round. Back, back. What do I need? Oh. Uh, oh, just hit. And his other attack. Hitting it, he's got two short swords and he's, uh, he's whacking it with both uh, short swords. Uh, hits it with one, completely misses with the other. The one that hits uh, um, manages to sort of like sway through two of its uh, tentacles that are coming out of its body and manages to uh, crop off one of them that falls to the floor and um, rives about for a moment or two, then kind of like hisses and bubbles and just melts away. Uh, Vanessa. Mm. Um, so if I cast a spell on it, it's basically my round casting the spell just set my weapon on fire. So 
We'll see if I survive around. Okay, Cormelan. Um, yeah, if I still have it in sight or can get it in sight by looking down the well carefully. No, it, it's basically got all its. It's got like tentacles on the side of the well as if it's trying to lower itself down. It hasn't actually lowered itself yeah. down yet. Okay. Um, then I will gladly stay back a, a pace or two. Yep. And throw my spear which should hit because it has a large defense still right that physical defense yeah no um mystical uh 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 uh, uh, uh no that's missed physical def got... uh mystic i've got bad news for you that was mystic armor that's what i was just about to ask was it mystic armor or mystic defense you know because i didn't armor. get to use the knack because okay. I wasn't weaving threads. So that's from Spirit Darts, that's Mystic Armor. Then again, it fizzes. Yep. Okay. And... Feeling, feeling, feeling super valuable right now. <laughs> oh, no. It's terrible, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, okay, so you've all had your go. The uh, Black Mound, um, with its uh, tentacles on the side of, of the well, kind of like just um, slithers down deeper into the well and disappears into the darkness drop a torch in okay are you, we still you... in combat uh well no it's, it's 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 dropped down so you're not in combat now well just shoot the spear down the well then okay so you drop a a torch down the well and you just see it um as it's kind of like it hit the bottom writhing about and then moves out of the um, out of the the bottom of the well to wherever the the stream water is coming in from, so you would think. Well, well, it's a well. Well, well we didn't do a... well. <laughs> I am very much underwhelmed. Whelmed with our performance here. Well, I yes. think it was difficult to grasp its pattern. It kept flowing and writhing about, so I think it's easier to hit a large blob in the physical realms with a sword than grasping tiny flecks of pattern in all this mess. Yes, but I'm starting to understand the appeal of the sword. <laughs> Way of the sword rather than the way of the pen. It's a really fancy sword, though. You haven't got the equivalent mage staff or whatever. Yeah. Okay, so like, uh, Kind, uh, uh Kerdow was sort of like said, uh, yeah, I think, I think, I think that was the same as that other one that we saw. What do you think? I think it was. Yeah, it definitely was the same. Trouble is, it's now escaped. Well, and... so let's go. <laughs> Should we ha should we maybe uh, put some boards over this well? Well, stone plates maybe. Boards won't help much. There's no Actually, villagers left. You've you've killed all the. Uh, uh, well, um, not not killed. You've uh, freed all the uh, villagers that were in between states. Herdar, could you pass a message for me to someone in town? Sure. Okay, so. I'll um I'll write a message to Cohen Brew to tell him what we found here, and that there is this blob in the well that we didn't manage to capture, but we have to move on quickly in order to attend to the other stuff that's very important, and that we have dispatched the clever men that were half done, and that we know that the Legion of the Hand was here for some reason, and we're not sure if they're working for SNK or against SNK, because they seem to have fought him, but they also seem to be doing his bidding. No, so the that Legion he... of the Le You've got no information that the Legion of the Hand fought SNK. That was the Grim Legion. Educated guess. Eight people. So eight people were here, not, that, not SNK. So who killed the first blob? The, 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 the eight that you 
have found the Legion of the Hand symbol for. That's the Legion of the Hand, not Grim Legion. Yeah. I think we just have a confusion here. The the Legion of the Hand was here in this small little village and killed a blob. This is what we want to relay, and we want to relay yep. that we are not sure if they are after Isenki or yep. for Isenki. Right. Okay. Yeah. Got you. This one, I just wanted to make sure that was clear. But yeah, that's correct. I obviously misheard. That's that's cleared up. So that's mostly it. And if he has any concerns that the blob is of danger, maybe he can send someone to look at it and take care of it as well. Because it has yes. very unfortunately eluded us. After it slinkered down the well. Following well. some failed attempts to spell cast a few spears on both of our spellcasters' parts. <laughs> Yo, Vanessa was here, isn't it? Uh, <laughs> Kindow Oakenshire. What's going to happen later on? Ooh, don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, yeah, he'll he'll, he'll uh, take that message. So I presume you all. Head head back to uh, Dililikane, Dili whatever it's called. Stay here for probably the evening, seeing as though it's kind of like a couple of hours walk there, a couple of hours walk back, and uh, catch a riverboat tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, you're going, I presume you're going back north to Marek rather than back to Duranis. Yep. We need to press on. Right. Okay. Uh right, right. I'm gonna have to be. Um, I'm gonna say we're gonna have to finish there. <laughs> yeah. I have I have some stuff prepared for the next bit, but it's all kind of like in bitty notes, and uh, I didn't actually expect you to get this far for once. But that, that's what happens when we've only got three players, I suppose. There's less discussion time needed. We uh, we can yeah, get I actually. Uh, actually, I'm not too 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 sad if we uh quit now because then i can get some rest yeah i mean i was thinking so if, i mean if I, it's i've got i've got stuff here written down of how to get you to merrick and get you to the tomb and stuff but this okay. was, this was written fine. quite a while ago and needs modifications for sure fine that's not the problem we can finish now now if you'd have gone to the to the life rock that would have padded out this next half an hour but you didn't so there we go <laughs> that's what's fine there's no point making it happen if you're not ready for it uh we've had a quite a good session I, I don't see the reason to just artificially bloat it so that we can play for half an hour more yeah exactly this that, would I, be... that's what i think but i just thought i'd be honest about this is the very first time where, where i've underestimated where you would get to <laughs> All right, I'll do some resting on a slow boat journey up. Right, I'll say goodbye to the stream, and then if people want to chat, we can have a chat. I'm going to go for a wee after that, though. Bye! Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye-bye. Bye. Thanks for watching. The Circle of Gold. See you next time. Bye.